Hey, I'm JR, and I'm here today to tell you about the JBL Bar 5.1. It is a 5.1 or surround sound sound bar. It consists of a couple pieces. The main sound bar itself is a three channel sound bar. That means it has nine speakers built in, six mid range speakers, and three tweeters. The system also comes with two wireless surround speakers and a wireless subwoofer, hence the 5.1. The sound bar itself is very good at enhancing the dialogue in whatever it is you're watching on TV. And that's thanks to the six mid-range speakers and three tweeters built into the main bar itself. Uh, it does have a dedicated center channel speaker as well as a left and a right speaker. So your front three speakers are built into the main bar. Your two wireless surround speakers, as you can see here, are connected to the main bar. When you actually wanna watch a movie, you take them off of the bar and you set them up behind you to give you good surround sound effects. So these speakers are really good at delivering you that surround sound detail. When you're done watching, you put them back on the bar to charge the battery. We set the system up in our training room recently and we really love just how much added surround sound effects you really got from these little wireless surround speakers. Uh, for as small as they are, they really make themselves known. It's a very sort of alive surround sound effect. And of course the subwoofer packs a punch as well. A nice big 10 inch sub with plenty of power that pairs wirelessly with the surround bar. So it is a real legitimate home theater system in a pretty small package. The bar, as well as the wireless surround speakers, are wall mountable. So if you want to get them up and out of your way, or if you have a wall mounted TV, you can put that bar right under the TV on the wall so it looks great too. The system does come with a calibration microphone, and when you plug it into the bar and run the calibration system, it plays a bunch of sounds on the speakers, bounces sound all around your room, and the microphone listens to it, picks it up, and calibrates it so your room sounds more like a movie theater. As far as connecting the sound bar to your TV and your AV system, uh, you got a lot of flexibility here. If you'd like to plug your source units, like your cable box, your gaming system, your Blu-ray player, right into the sound bar, you can do that. There's three HDMI inputs on the back, and then a fourth HDMI, which is an output that goes to your TV. That's also an audio return channel connection, which means you can get the sound from your TV back down into your sound bar. So no matter what you're watching, you'll be able to hear it on the sound bar. If you'd prefer to just plug all of your sources directly into your TV, that's fine as well. You can just run that HDMI with audio return channel from your TV back to the bar, or use an optical digital output, or you can even plug in stuff using an analog audio connection. The bar also has a USB input on the back so that you can plug a, uh, like a thumb drive in uh, with music loaded on it and listen to music that way. And it has Bluetooth, so if you wanted to stream music to the soundbar directly from your phone or tablet, you can do that as well. The system comes with a really nice remote control with dedicated buttons for volume as well as subwoofer level and surround level control. So you can really dial in the exact sound you want for your room. You can even invoke uh, other sound modes like for music versus movies or a night mode in case you don't want to wake the kids up while you still want to watch a movie. So that's the JBL Bar 5.1 Surround Sound Soundbar. We were really impressed. We think you might like it as well. If you like this video, please hit like, uh, subscribe to our channel, and leave any questions you might have in the comments. We will try to answer those for you. Thanks for watching.